siding, windows, and gutters. All right, we are back about a quarter before 6 o'clock already on this Thursday. Another mild and quiet start to the day. Threat tracker remains in the green the rest of the week through the weekend. At most, we could see maybe a sprinkle or a brief shower tomorrow, then again Saturday, although tomorrow's chance is better to the south, and even there it's pretty slim. Uh, there will be rain through western Nebraska tomorrow into central Nebraska, uh, probably by tomorrow evening and again on Sunday. But that front that's going to approach us will move very slow. So I'm thinking probably Sunday night, Monday is our next real good chance for anything significant as far as rain and thunderstorms. Outside this morning, skies already beginning to lighten. My goodness, here we are a quarter before 6 o'clock. You can see kind of some scattered clouds. They seem to be breaking up a little bit as we look back toward the southeast. A little bit thicker in that direction, at least from 680 and Dodge here. 54 comfortable degrees with a very tame wind out of the south southeast at 7. And once again, no rain since midnight, so we finally get a chance to uh, continue to dry out here. Temperatures a little bit coolest to the northwest and to the east of us. In fact, the coolest weather we can find, southwestern Iowa, northwestern Missouri this morning. Right now, Clorinda 43. Down on the campus of Northwest Missouri State, still 46, Atlantic, Iowa, checking in the same way. And then it bounces to 54 here in the metro, 50 in Fremont, and then back down to 47 as we head towards Wayne. All right, a little different vantage point for you as we look at our exclusive street level mapping on our Viper HD. This is the satellite feature. Council Bluffs down toward Lake Manawa and then back toward downtown. All looking pretty good. You saw the sky cast there, just a few scattered clouds. And most of that east and south of the city, at least the latest little batch, you can see a little more clearing here from Omaha north and west now, and then other areas of clouds. I didn't really notice much in the way of fog this morning driving in, but we've seen that develop a little bit through parts of the area, so just keep that in mind. Doesn't really look like a big deal, and once again, we're continuing dry. Maps into motion through the morning show the same type of thing for the third day in a row. We quickly get into the 60s. There was a hint of maybe a little sprinkle there as some of these clouds build up. But again, I think most of us, it's about a 10% chance, and that's all it would be is a couple of raindrops if we were going to see it in any one spot. Otherwise, for the third day in a row, yeah, we hit 72 yesterday and Tuesday. I, why not? I think we're going to do that again as we head towards this afternoon. And once again, the winds for the third day in a row, not much of a factor. South to southeast at about 10 miles per hour. So with partly sunny skies today, again, a lot of the clouds will break away. Probably get a good shot of what's becoming a near full moon out there. Uh, 52 for the overnight low, and then tomorrow, more the same. Very slight chance of a sprinkle. Highs at about 75. Saturday, also about a 10% chance of a sprinkle with a high of 78. And then even Sunday, I still think the majority of the rain and storm chances remain west. Will be partly sunny there. 82. Then we talk about rain and maybe some stronger storms late Sunday night into Monday. And then on and off, timing and position of all those uh, clusters of storms a little early to detail this far in advance, but know that we will stay active with the possibility of some rain Tuesday and again on Wednesday. And with that being said, just a reminder, you can download Storm Shield to your smartphone. Great weather app to have. Uh, if we get watches in the mornings, you'll get notification to your phone. You can track the action on radar. And if you have a good old-fashioned landline, there's actually a voice call that you can sign up for as well for that feature. So uh, we got you covered. Nobody exempt from severe weather protection here. All right, 547 right now. Uh, we're looking at 54 degrees, partly cloudy skies. Stay with us.